At, in other news, two children died in a house fire in Philadelphia's Strawberry Mansion this morning. At least two other people were hurt. Alicia Reed joins us from Strawberry Mansion with what authorities know so far. Good afternoon, Alicia. Jim, this was a complete tragedy for the family involved. This fire started just before 5 o'clock this morning, and firefighters rushed to the scene. However, it was difficult for them to find a working fire hydrant. Neighbors tell me they went to surrounding blocks in the Strawberry Mansion neighborhood before they were able to find water. Neighbors tell me the family has seven children, one as young as a few months old. Some managed to escape through the back of the home here on the 2400 block of North Myrtlewood Street. There was a lot of chaos and screaming out front, but once they realized two of the children were still inside, neighbors say their father went back in to try and save them. He ended up with burns and unfortunately two and the four year old were both killed in that fire. Three adults were treated at the scene, then transported to the hospital. Now fire officials say the blaze started on the first floor, then went up to the second floor. Officials say about 60 firefighters, medics, and support personnel responded to the scene, battling heavy rain, rain and winds while aggressively putting the fire out. Now, the family moved to this block about a year ago, and during this tragedy, neighbors stepped in to help. He looks like he might have had some injuries to himself for trying to go back in and try to get save his children and stuff and put the fire out. And it's, we have a neighbor down the street who took in the other children and them to make sure the other children them was, you know, with safety and stuff. I can't imagine, and I'm watching so many people around here, their horrifying faces this morning, watching as the firemen and them carry these babies and stuff out. And it, it's, it's terrifying, even down to their pet and stuff. It's, it's really devastating, and they lost everything. Neighbors say nearby fire hydrants have been out for a few months now, and although they've called, no one has come to fix them. Meanwhile, a nearby funeral home has offered to pay for the children's funeral expenses. Reporting live from North Philly, Alicia Reed, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Very sad news. Thank you, Alicia.